Hello friends. Um, I'm working on my website, my new website for the parasite, and I realized on I'm on the last few symptoms and I didn't have any videos about to put up about them or pictures. It's really kind of hard to show waxy film in the shower or hair falling out. I mean, I can show you the top of my head, but unless there's a comparison of how many hairs per square inch I had before, I can't really show you how many squares per inch I have now. So what I did was um, in the shower, I just scraped off some of the film and then it, it um, I have pictures. So check out my blog, um, the secret is gratitude.com and type in waxy film in the search box at the bottom of the homepage. And you'll see pictures of this film as I scraped it out of my fingernails. And then I transferred it. I wanted you to be able to see what it was like. And so I transferred it to a pair of black sweats because I wanted um, you to be able to see how it spreads like a waxy it's almost like a deodorant texture so I just took my finger and spread it like that um, and you can see that the little pieces um, they're not like dead skin so I did some dead skin over here so you can see the difference so it makes a waxy film I wish I'd started the video before I did that I didn't think about making a video until after so it's it's almost like a a, a deodorant I mean I, I'll get my deodorant out and I'll show you. Well, let's try it, see what happens with my deodorant because I call it a waxy film because it's kind of like a, sorry, it's kind of hard to do with my hand. But that, that texture is like that kind of. So let's scrape some of that off on there. Okay, so that's my deodorant, that yellowy um, tan one. It's rose and vanilla Smith's natural deodorant. So it's kind of got a waxy base to it. So if I smear that, you can see that it kind of leaves simmer marks and waxy. Now I'm probably gonna have a, um, actually it doesn't even leave the smear as waxy, a little bit, but it's kind of peeling off. But the yet the, the stuff off my skin so gross I'm doing this <laughs> it's so disgusting I'm sc my shit is my skin scrapings and it's waxy it's so gross anyway you can see this kind of has like an oil base and it's kind of leaving a, a stain this does not have any kind of staining like that this is just a waxy substance I don't know what it is but it's waxy and that's I've never had that in my life until these parasites and they started on my neck and chest and that's where it usually is the worst and the thickest over the lungs so I'm wondering if it's part of like its second life cycle where it climbs up and is in the thyroid area because it I mean I do have it elsewhere in the body but not as uh, strongly as there yeah you can see this is now leaving grease marks greasy um, it's just a different texture you can see it's just a little different no, I'm gonna have stains on my sweat. Okay, so that's the waxy film. Um, I'm also gonna put this on this video, the hair falling out. So one shampoo and one comb, like, and this isn't even all of it. I didn't think about doing this till after, so I kind of pulled this out of the trash because, I, like I said, I hadn't thought about doing it. However, you can see that these are all just kind of long and they're coming out by the... the um, the bulb, like the, let's see if you can see, let me see if, so these long ones, they just come out and they're coming out by the root. And um, they, they're they not just falling, well they do fall out, like if I run my hand through my hair, some falls out, but, um, and that's kind of what this was, you can kind of, hopefully you can see there's, there's bulbs on the end of these. And so they just come out long and like this. And every time I straighten my hair, I lose a hundred or more hairs. And when I comb it, it's not as bad, but if I try and straighten it, it comes out. And this is just from, like I clean my brush every time I use it. So this is just from one brushing. So that's kind of frustrating. But I want to show you the difference um, on the dead skin versus um, the waxy film. So after like the shower I got out and I just scraped off um, this is just, my skin is so dry. Can I, hopefully you can see it's just so dry. And so every time I wear black, this is what gets on my clothes. I mean, granted I'm collecting it all on one piece of fabric, 
but that's what happens because my skin is so dry. It's just every time I, and, and I put lotion and creams. In fact, you can see I've got a whole bunch right here. I just, whatever I pull out of the cupboard, I've got to use. I've got some more oils over here. I just use whatever is around. Um, and I'm trying them for different things. I was trying this black cumin and um, lemon on the skin to see if I could get the, the parasites to come out and it didn't work. But um, now I'm taking it internally. It does, I actually calm my stomach. Um, so something in the black cumin um, and a little bit of the, I just do a dash of the lime, um, is calming my stomach from the parasites. It calms them down. I don't know if it pushes them away or coats the leaky gut or whatever. So that's, there's those that I bought this last month and try am trying currently. So I just wanted to share those three things. Kind of a disgusting video. I'm going to throw this in the wash right now, but I wanted to share those three things because I realized um, I'm in trying to finish my, that's my goal uh, for New Year's is to hurry and get the, the web page out. So um, I will unveil that hopefully in the next week. I'm really, really close. I'm on my last three symptoms and then I need to do things I've tried and um, then I'll be done. So that's what um, I'm working on currently, but check out my blog. I'll take pictures of all of these things and post on there a little bit. At thesecretisgratitude.com, type in waxy film, hair loss, this will come up. And uh, thanks for watching and I hope you have a very blessed day.